everybody. It's been a while. I'm just walking through the woods over here, kind of checking everything out. Uh, quite a bit of brush on this trail that I'm walking on here. I'm over on the coach right now, kind of just checking some things out. Kind of see what I'm seeing here. So you see what a nice, lovely little stream. Very peaceful out here. The birds are chirping. Definitely springtime. And what I wanted to talk about today was actually something a little different. And that was like what what in the world is going on with everything. Um, I think this thing is just going to be more so a peaceful walk in the woods and kind of visiting everything out here as we talk about maybe some more dramatic things. So as you can see here, beautiful streams running by right here. We have a little spring here. It's kind of popped out. Here you get that little up close view of it here. And what I wanted to mainly talk about is kind of where society is uh, like so far lost. So we've advanced so far, you know, bear with me on this, right? And share your thoughts, what you think. We've advanced so far that we've lost so much. What do I mean by that? Well, I mean more so that, you know, as a society, we don't even talk and associate with one another too much on a day-to-day -day basis. It seems like you go to the store and it's like a complete war zone of chaos sometimes. It seems like sometimes everybody's in such a hurry and everybody is so concerned about the me, me, me in their own life and lose sight of the real picture and, and what's important as well in life. And that is being able to, you know, care for your fellow brother or sister, right? Be able to just have a normal conversation and uh, not feel um, just uh, not, not feel as, as if it's so um, distant what I'm trying to say and it's so just bewildered so gone um, almost like having the conversation is completely foreign to most people guys that's insane here's another spring by the way it's pretty noisy right now but it's uh, very beautiful don't get me wrong little fish tank back here uh, definitely neat little spot for sure Nice little western red cedar here. Anyways, guys, um, like we've gone so far is what I'm trying to say. But then we've lost so much at the same time. And so will we get it back? I'm not sure, you know. But I would love to see the day where people get off the screen sometimes and go out and just enjoy nature like this like you're seeing right here. This amazing scene. You're not gonna get that anywhere else, guys. Except out in nature. And so, you know, you may be watching this video at home and may be sitting and you're not out in nature at the time, right? And that happens, guys. That honestly happens. Happens to the best of us. Um, but the biggest thing that I'm saying, bring it back around, is go out and get up because we're meant to move. We're meant to, you know, uh, exercise. We're meant to use our bodies. We're meant to see others. We're meant to visit. We're meant to share, you know, help others do good things. Uh, we're not meant to just be 
you know, glued to these white screens all day long. And or we're not meant to not socialize and talk to one another and love one another. And I don't want this to sound like some like crazy Gandhi speech or something. You know, that's not what this is. This is more so, you know, I think we could fix societal issues and, and things and dra dramatic drama uh, if we just got along as a people. You know, you may not always um, agree with somebody, but at least have enough d decency to agree to disagree and respect one another as a person. Unless somebody gives you reason to where they're just um, intentionally uh, rude all the time or something, right? Uh, but res have respect for one another. And, uh, you know, it goes a long way in life. So that would be what I want to share with you guys today. I'm just out here taking a little trip in the woods, checking things out out here on uh, this property. And... Uh, kind of enjoying the view of everything. I know here's a here's another one. Here's a little close up. So this here is called skunkweed. And skunkweed, believe it or not, kind of smells like weed. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's ironic, right? It's, it's in the name, skunkweed. Well, weed. But uh, yeah, it kind of smells like weed. So as I'm walking out here, I'm thinking there's like a marijuana operation, but it's not. It's just this little bit of stuff growing by the creek and the streams. But yeah, guys, uh, that's what I want to say to you, honestly. Is I know it's been a while, but I'm going to try to get out here and film and get some nature walks, you know, a lot sooner and more often. So that way it uh, gives you guys something to look forward to, too, you know, as we kind of talk and visit. And, you know, that's what I want to kind of see with this, you know, more outdoorsy kind of channel um, and enjoying life a little bit. So, all right. Well, until next time, you guys take care. God bless, and uh, drop me a comment. Let me know what you think about where you see things headed or, or where you see the world right now. I know it's kind of an interesting situation. I don't, I'm not a doomsday person. I don't think this is the end at all. I think that we can fix it. I just think we need to do those things that I mentioned, right? So, all right, peace.